Hi Libra, it is Veronica here to do your December 2024 tarot reading. So we're going to do two spreads. The first spread will be all of December. The second spread will be your next step, which is the end of December moving into January. Okay. All right. Hope you're well. So here we go. Libra, your central issue today is the King of Cups reversed. Recent history, Five of Wands reversed. Next step, Queen of Pentacles. What's crowning you is the Strength Upright. And your foundation today is the Ten of Wands. Interesting. So the Ten of Wands is a massive burden. You trying to move forward, but you're stuck, or you've got a lot of wands on your back, a lot of ideas, a lot of thoughts, a lot of drama that you've been trying to get rid of, or the aftermath of drama. We have Sagittarius and Aries coming through right now, okay? As well as Leo crowning, water energies, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. But um, if we just look at the cards, the energy is saying you've got a lot of passion for something, and that could have caused drama or competition in the past, or you were competing for a role or something you had going on in your life. And then we have this. We have a masculine energy in reverse, which is someone who's actually insincere, uh, lacks empathy, not always a narcissist. Just know that because the rest of the cards do not scream narcissist, but someone who's emotionally shut down, doesn't want to open up right now because they fear, you know, the unknown or they fear that it's going to weigh them down more or cause problems. Then we have this, the money check. The security, stability, the good mom, parent, whatever, the person that you can rely on. She, because she came out upright, is also very passionate. We have all earth and Leo, Sagittarius, Aries for this woman. The I would say it's less Sagittarius, more Aries, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or Leo. This is someone that has pushed a lot aside to do um, for her family, for her friends, for even herself. This is also a raise, a promotion of any kind, even if it's just a title, um, can also be like having to carry her husband, partner, spouse, whatever, financially, because this person's trying to get a job and there's too much competition. It's a, they're a burden. This could be a bum, I'm sorry to say. Could be. Libra. Ooh. If you're a male, if you're a Libra man, you're really trying to cut out the drama in your life, specifically with women. I'm not saying we're the drama. I'm saying there is drama for Leo. Libra, Leo. <laughs> is that Leo? Now, here's the thing about this. If you felt that maybe you couldn't do something for someone, whether you were physically debilitated or financially, although I don't have financial cards here, you just said no, and it probably upset them. And then the feminine energy is being forced to do on her own, which by the way, she's doing great. Don't worry. Like if you feel bad for having to say no or for not being able to provide, it's fine. Like maybe she doesn't need it to say Show me the Queen of Pentacles. I'm very curious. If you're a Libra woman, well, you look great. Uh -huh. The only issue that is here is Sagittarius, Aries, and Leo not getting along. Family, friends, something. Okay. Show me the strength card. Oh, we're stuck on something. Okay, someone is very passionate about another or about a situation or project. I think it's person for the majority. I feel like they're passionate about them and they can't let it go and they can't speak about it. We now have Leo, Scorpio, and Libra again. So Libra, you're definitely involved with not speaking your truth or telling someone how you feel or being able to make something happen legally because you're not allowed to say something or you signed an NDA or whatever. This King of Cups for ladies bothers me. 
Cancer energy, Sagittarius energy, Scorpio. Yeah, those are the signs for the masculine energy around Libra ladies if it's negative. They're, um, they're touchy, especially if they're a Scorpio dude or a Cancer dude. I'm just ugh, not digging them right now. I'm feeling like they're not telling you everything. If you need to know something, they're not telling you. If you're the chick with the money and you're a Libra woman, please, you're another one I have to warn. They're, they're very sneaky. They may care for you, but they're also very sneaky. So maybe they get into investing or something that ends up becoming a burden or they're just like, they're another one that makes me wonder if they're just emotionally stable. Okay. Okay. Outcome for this first spread. All right. Water. Oh, yeah. Water sign masculines are going to be an issue for my Libras, mostly Libra women. Libra men, it's about providing and being passionate and trying to stay out of drama. Okay. But you guys, you guys got so much drama, ladies. Okay. Um, okay. Someone is lying about who they are. And I don't know how they're lying about it. I just know, like, it's emotionally driven. So I feel like it's something that may have, they may have done or a situation from their past they don't want you to know about. Okay. <laughs> it's like they don't want you to change your mind about them. That's really what I get, specifically because of the strength card and the queen of pentacles like you look incredibly solid now could this be an earth sign or a leo person that you are not opening up to yes specifically if you have water in your moon or rising and you're a libra sun and you're a man okay i don't want them to know interesting Okay, it's not earth shattering, but it's a fear they have of someone not seeing them the same way. It could be anything, but it's emotionally driven. So that's how they're making their choices. Next step, Libra. Next step. Truth's coming out, High Priestess in reverse. We can't keep it quiet for much longer, whatever it is. I said we meaning a lot of people. Page, wow. Oh, I know what's happened. No shit. Page of Swords Reverse. Someone's been spying on someone and they collected info. That's coming out. It doesn't matter why. I think the person that's been spied on is going to be pissed or they are pissed. Oh, shit. I have Air, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and I have Pisces. Not okay. This is doesn't feel good to me. Fire. Money. Oh no. Oh shit. <sighs> this is heavy. Someone's been stalking someone. Not spying, stalking. This is really like an obsession for someone. Either, Libra, you're going to find out about this. You are doing this. But I have two energies, air and fire. Or it's air and Capricorn, air and Pisces, fire and Pisces. Virgo's also here. There's a Money's being lost because of this obsession. So someone's obsessed with something that's costing someone money. You, them, everybody. Okay. It's a big deal. It's a big fucking deal. Capricorn season in December, there's going to, the loss will show up. Okay. Meaning that if someone was doing the books and they didn't catch it or something else, but then the person that I think this already happened, the person that's been spying, watching, stalking, they've been caught. There's a new opportunity to make money coming. Specifically, if you have children that need to make money or someone that owes you money or you owe them, there's new opportunities, okay? It'll be fine. But you have to be upfront and honest about maybe criminal past. 
Maybe someone has a criminal past and you didn't know it and now you're finding out. Especially for my Libra women. And I'm sorry, I'm not stereotyping, I'm pulling it. So I feel like Libra women, you're finding out this younger masculine who's going to be a Gemini, an Aries, a Leo, a Sag, a Pisces, a Virgo, or a Capricorn has an issue. Someone's been stalking someone. Now, the other thing I'm getting, this is really kind of crazy. If they were being paid to stalk someone and then the job ended, they're continuing to stalk them. Both people that are in question are younger to Libra ladies because they're coming through much younger. See, they may not be taking the money because they want to, they want to stock anyway. Maybe the job's done and that's coming out. Again, this person has a criminal history. Oh my God. Uh, whoever's involved in this, they're, they are getting ready to defend. Someone's going to court, I think, but they're getting ready to defend themselves over what they're doing. Or they're trying to protect the purse. Oh, shit. Libra, I don't know who you are, male or female, I don't know, with this message. Whoever was stalking, here it is. Here's the stalkerific energy who is no longer taking the money. They're protecting the person that either you had stalked or someone else had stalked. They're protecting them now. That's why they're doing it. Because they found something and they didn't report it. Oh, God. And they're trying to protect this person, probably because they're attracted to him. Because look, it's attractive energy. Uh-oh. How come? What the fuck is going on? Do you know these people? Oh, they're not going to jail either. Interesting. So, again, they do have a criminal past. Maybe they're out of jail now or they didn't get convicted of whatever. They're not going to jail probably because they turned their life around and now they're maybe doing something to protect people. That's the best I can do. This could be one of your kids. Don't know what to say. <laughs> I'm blown away. I'm blown away. What's going on? Oh my gosh. Okay. Who are we dealing with? This is for Libra. Who are we dealing with? Thank you guys for the gifts today. I appreciate you so much. Scorpio. Aries. You had that fire. Sagittarius, Aquarius, bottom of the deck. <sighs> okay, good luck. It's not really bad, it's just there's a lot of the Libra energy coming through for December feels like you guys are watching stuff or you're being found out, whatever you were hiding, not necessarily a, the worst thing in the world. But if you find out there's been a stalker involved with someone, you know, you're going to find out a whole lot of shit and you're going to be blown away. It's that's what I'm getting in a nutshell. Okay, that's it. <laughs> At least for now, I will be doing check in readings periodically. If you want to become a subscriber, I've got sub only readings already up. I have new ones coming this week. I appreciate you guys so, so much. Thank you. And I will see you soon.